Hey people, it's a car mukbang and I have McDonald's and I'm supposed to be on a diet but hear me out. So, Coke Zero. Mm. I dyed my hair. I gave my hairdresser um, free hands so to speak. So it's darker on the top, red on the bottom. I'm not really sure I'm feeling it. I like the color, it's just it doesn't feel like me, so I might change it. But anyway, I have um, garlic sauce. And I don't have a mic, which is why I'm doing a mukbang. I have um, a New Orleans burger. What? That's why I wanted to do this. Don't drop. And fries. I think uh, McDonald's fries are the only fries I actually like. I don't. I hate Burger King fries. Like I really don't like them. The burger fries are okay. And um. Yeah. So. <laughs> what a rumble. Um. Anyway. One thing I wanted to kind of touch base on is, well, first of all, this boyga. Oh my god, that looks good. Look at it. Oh, baby. Look at it. Looks amazing. I'm just going to put it here because, I mean, I'm, I've never done a car mukbang before I recently just got my license and I've been trying to like learn how to drive did not take the drive through it was packed and it's raining anyway the whole point why I'm doing like a cheat meal is because for once they have a New Orleans style something in in Finland and um, for those of you who know me or have followed me a long time you know that I'm you know sort of in a long distance relationship with Tuabebu uh, and Roberto and um, we met in New Orleans last year. Had an amazing, an amazing vacation, which kind of set the direction for our future. And once I found out they have a New Orleans style burger, and I told him about it, I was like, you know what? You should do a video of that. And originally, I didn't want to because. Um, now here's the trick. I'm recording this on Sunday. And it's crunch time for us because by Thursday, I should be in the States. Fingers crossed. And, um, I'm actually gonna upload this video once I'm there because uh, I wanted to let you guys know something if you're interested Berto and I are gonna start a vlog channel we actually already have um, I put the link down below but it's called love at first bite how cute he came up with the name and um, we have an Instagram account some of you guys have already found it we also have a YouTube account, obviously, for the videos. So, if you're interested, you can always follow us there because I'm still going to continue making ASMR videos on this channel, but mostly or like mukbangs and food related vlogs, which is what our channel is going to be like. Really, it's because it's love at first bite. We're going to go through different restaurants if you want to see 
my reactions to all kinds of um, American food. If you want to see where we go to, what we eat, what we think of it, food reviews, whatever, or our daily life, you can follow us there. If you're not that interested, no biggie. Two pack rest in peace. Well, that's the plan. That's the big news. If you're watching this, I will probably be in the States already. And we will probably post like little bits and pieces on Instagram. Maybe go live on Instagram on our Love at First Bite account. And um, we will most likely post something soon ish on the vlogging YouTube account. So. That's it, my, my nose is alright. I've just been eat, eating the burger. No burger. Fries. So, um, let's get into the burger. It has um, tex Texas Cajun sauce and spicy barbecue sauce. Some mayo, two slices of bacon, two beefs, um, smoked gouda cheese. Oh my gouda. This it. I love barbecue sauce. So. Mmm. It's definitely spicy. I liked it. <laughs> One thing you're gonna notice if you if you're gonna follow our vlog channel is him and I we're so silly together like I'm almost embarrassed to like show you guys how stupid we are. But I guess to us it's cute, so I don't know. I don't care. Mm. It seriously is so good. I got work in a bit and I'm not, you know, I'm not gonna eat anything else today except for fruits. So this <clears throat> is gonna be my breakfast, lunch and dinner. So hopefully it's enough for cr crunch time. Crunch. Crunchy. I'm literally so excited for all the food that I'm gonna get to try. Oh gosh, oh gosh. The hair, not really. Just don't feel like it's me. Uh. Oh, yeah, it had marinated red onion as well. Pickled or whatever you want to call it.
said, I'm not a very experienced driver yet. And I was driving an hour to work. And it was super rainy. And um, I was just thinking to myself, like, damn. Because when it rains in Finland, it rains the whole day. Whereas when I was living in uh, Belfast last year, I learned that it can rain and be full on sunshine in one day with like 30 minutes apart. And I, <laughs> I miss that because this whole rain, raining all day, no, like while I was driving, it wasn't getting, it wasn't getting like, it was heavy throughout the whole hour of driving. Now it's a little bit less heavy, but it's still raining. And throughout the whole hour, I was just hoping that it would stop raining. It was so horrible. I made it fine, but it's just don't. I don't like it. Technically, anything could happen. Okay. Any burger with barbecue sauce is a friend of mine. It's fine. It dropped on top of a uh, paper towel. But yeah, um, it's almost time to go to the state. I have like this day and tomorrow left at work, and then I had two days off, and then. I'm traveling for like a whole day. I can't wait. Um, the other day I had um, <clears throat> a co worker ask, When's the last time you saw him? And I was like, well, almost a year ago, and she, she and her, this other coworker of mine were like, damn, wow, a year ago? And I was, it, it really hit me. I was like, damn, because we were going to do this sooner, but then, you know, everything like kept changing on the way. And I'm glad I didn't know that I was going to wait a year in advance because, or like 10 to 11 months, because 
it would have been too hard. But it kind of hit me in the sense that and then this other coworker of mine was like, so are your parents or like getting sad or that you're leaving? And I was just thinking to myself like, First of all, they're not, but but second of all, I don't care. I'm not like 18 anymore. I waited a year to be with the person I want to be with. I waited long enough, you know. At this point, I don't care. Hmm. About the, you know, what are your parents gonna say? Are you gonna miss Finland? Are you gonna miss your parents? Are you gonna miss your dog? Like, I understand those questions, but if you gotta ask those questions, then you have no idea what it's been like waiting for a year. I hate to say it, but those things don't matter at this point. I'm gonna come back. It's not like I'm going away for a lifetime and never coming back. But I have my own life to live and getting closer to being 30 and... It's not like mommy's little girl is 18 and moving abroad or something like... I don't know. <clears throat> I guess I'm bad at explaining it, but... Every now and then I get like people being like, aren't you gonna miss home? No, I miss him. I'm done waiting, so. Anyway, I'm also done with um, the food. So, yeah. If you wanna follow us, like I said, link in the description. And um, I'm gonna go to work. I'm pretty boring on my own, but maybe once I'm with him, we're more fun or more dorky. You know? You know? You know? <laughs> ah, bye guys.